Okay, this is the fun part. You've got Snipe Algo, you're ready to start trading. You're gonna change your life with the lifestyle that Snipe Algo gives you with that 97% win rate. But even more valuable than that, in my opinion, is the fact that you'll no longer be chained to your charts. You'll no longer have to stare at your computer screen all day, watch the charts and wait for a buy signal or a sell signal. You'll no longer have to chart, do preparation, set your levels, and so much more. This is the lifestyle. Here's what you do. You wake up in the morning, you wait for a text message because Snipe Algo's artificial intelligence, it knows how to trade. You don't need to know what the market's doing. You could care less what the news is. Snipe Algo does all of that. It considers all of the market for you and it will very simply tell you when a trade is getting close. So the purpose of this video again is to help you set up your alerts and we'll get to that in just a moment. But what a lifestyle. You'll have plenty of time to log into your phone, any device you want to trade with. You'll go right to that strike price for that call or that put. You'll tee up the number of contracts you want to buy. You'll have a market order ready to go, and you're just going to wait for that alert on your phone. And when Snipe Algo tells you buy your puts or buy your calls, one click, you're done because you've set your profit target, and you go live your life. And Snipe Algo will give you three high-quality trades a day. Winning 97 out of 100. Okay, let's get to it. Let's talk about how do you set up those alerts. So you'll need your trading view open. You'll need Snipe Algo installed. And here's where we're gonna go. It's much easier to do this on a computer screen and for recording purposes, I'm gonna demonstrate how to set up your alerts on a computer. Of course, if you're doing this on an iPad or an iPhone or an Android, that's fine too. Remember, once you set up your alerts one time, your device can be off. You don't need your computer on, your iPhone, anything. Your alerts will always happen. Pro tip, when and if we update the algorithm, it's important you delete your old alerts and always install new alerts based on the most current version of Snipe Algo. All of this information, by the way, is right on our website and in our FAQs. But here we go. Okay, we're in trading view, and as you can see, I've got my spy chart up, SPY and I'm in the one minute time frame. Lastly, I've installed Snipe Algo, and the way we know that is our Snipe Algo dashboard is right there. Of course, in the settings of Snipe Algo, you can move your dashboard anywhere you'd like, but we can see that I've got it right here. By the way, what a trade this was on this day, huh? We bought the calls and rode them all the way up just about to the market close. I bet that was a banger. All right, so we want to set up alerts so we can get text notifications and push notifications when these yellow staging indicators occur. Let's zoom into those for a moment. What we're talking about is the countdown, right? Five, four, three, two, one. We'd like to get text notifications and push notifications on our phones so we don't have to watch our charts. You can also get a text notification when the countdown is aborted. And look how patient the algo was. We had a false start there, we didn't take the trade, another false start, didn't take the trade, another false start, and the algo correctly aborted every time. The price then dipped, and we finally got in a lot later at a cheaper price, and, though, and although it dipped again, the trade ended up being a big winner, just like, oh, about 97 out of every 100 trades we get end up being. Okay, so let's add alerts. The way we do that is we go to the top right, we click on this alarm clock, which is the alerts icon, and it opens up a pane. Now, I've already set up one alert, buying calls on the SPY. So how do we add more? Well, it's very simple. We click the plus button right here. When we click the plus button, it will open up another window. The first thing we need to know is what notifications we're setting up. You can see that I've checked everything except Webhook. Webhook is really only used for advanced technology and automation of your spy trades. You can notify in-app, which I love. It'll send a push notification right to your phone if you have the TradingView app installed. You can get pop-ups on your actual chart, which will appear here. Send an email will do just that. It sends an email to you, but who watches emails in real time? Play sound is important because it'll actually make a sound on your computer screen or on your device that has TradingView installed. And to me, the most important, send email to SMS. 
Click this question mark for more details on how to do it, but here's what you'll need to do. In order to send a text message to your phone, just go to Google. Let's say you have AT&T or Verizon Wireless. Just Google the following phrase. How to send a text message to my AT&T phone. Or how to send a text message to my Verizon phone. What you'll end up finding is you text your phone number to your phone number at, for example, text.att.net, something like that. If you Google it, you'll get the exact string of the email address to send messages to and test it out before setting it up in TradingView. Once you figure out your personal email address that will send a text message to your phone, try it. Use your email client and just send an email to that with the subject line of testing and you'll find that you get a text message immediately to your phone that says testing in it. All right, so now we've done all that. We've checked all of these alerts. We figured out how to send a text message to our phone. And again, you can click the question mark to get the exact details on how to do that right within TradingView. Let's go back to the settings. These are the standard alerts you can set on the ticker spy. But what you want to do is go to Snipe Algo's alerts and you can set up all of these separate alerts. There are six alerts I want to talk to you about and then you can whittle down from there and reduce or increase. But before we get to the actual alerts, very important. Every alert you ever set should be once per bar close. Not only once, because what will happen, you'll never get it again. Once per bar close, not once per bar, not once per minute, once per bar close. We use one minute bars and we want that alert once it's finalized when the bar closes. That's exactly how the algo works. Always once per bar close. Lastly, Open-ended alert. What does that mean? Open-ended says you'll always get alerts from now until infinity until you delete this alert. Every day, every time there's an alert, it'll send it to you. You can name the alert whatever you want. So let's go back to what types of alerts you can select. Well, there's six that I recommend you start with. All staging long and all staging short. Those are those yellow right there. All staging is the yellow, and of course you can change those colors as well, but it's the 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 countdowns. That's what staging is. So all staging long would be the calls. All staging short would be the puts. The long signal would be this, the actual signal to buy your calls right here. That's very important. So you'd want to set that for both the calls, which would be the long signal, and the puts, which would be the short signal. And lastly, if you'd like to know every time the countdown aborts, be sure you select the long sequence aborted and the long, excuse me, the short sequence aborted. So we know that I've already set up the long signal, right? The buy calls, and I named it buy calls SPY. So let's just set up all of the staging so you can see how it's done. We'll select all staging long, once per bar close, and we can name it. So we'll name it SPY, all staging, calls, or long, however you'd like. You can name it whatever you'd like. Don't change anything here. This is the code that allows the alerts to be smart for you. It'll tell you SPY, it'll tell you it's a long entry, and it'll tell you how many minutes away, and it'll even calculate for you the strike price. Keep in mind, you only get the strike price when you're three minutes or less away from the actual call signal. Click Create. That window disappears. And look, there's your new alert. And if I drag this down, you can see it added that alert on top of the previous alert I had already set. So now I have Buy Calls on SPY. That's the actual signal here. SPY Calls, when to buy. And the alert we just created together, SPY All Staging for Calls. And that would be all of these yellow countdowns, every five, four, three, two, one, etc. And you'd have to do the same for the puts. Lastly, you can add the abort signals as well. I hope this has been informative and instructive. Feel free to rewind, watch as many times as you want. If my instructions are confusing for any reason at all, there's plenty of resources out there on YouTube or even on the TradingView website. But at the end of the day, when you're done with these alerts, wow. You're gonna love it. Okay, that's it. You're all set. Your alerts are set up, or at least you know how. You can always watch this video again. Now you can change your life because Snipe Algo will give you that lifestyle.
that we all want. Take your profits, don't get greedy. But more importantly, the lifestyle. Now, you don't have to be glued to a computer all day. Just wait for the alerts. They'll tell you when you're, when you're getting close. They'll tell you exactly what strike price to set up ready to buy. And they'll tell you when to buy. Welcome to winning. We're glad to have you as a customer.